Hello, greetings. This is Gilles. I come to share some essential wisdom. For for I wanted to say that illumination, truth, and and um, and freedom cannot come from without. It will not come from without because we we are here to to regain our powers of creator. So we have to find this inner power. And I congratulate you for the work you've already done on yourself. For we've done a lot of work through this this past few months. A lot of work has been done. From when you go inside and you do not find a total bliss and joy and freedom, it is natural. For you have the courage to address those those wounded part of yourself, those shadows. All those things need to be addressed in order to be released. And so it is very important to to continue to do this work because we can no longer stand the, the tyranny. We, we have to say yes to freedom and no to tyranny. All those things that are depriving of our freedom is really uh, is something that is imposed but is no longer necessary. As we awaken, we'll find that uh, we're going to find... <coughs> Sorry, I just quit, I've been quitting smoking and coffee and those things are really... Um, I'm still eliminating. Very soon we're going to be clear of those old things, those old programs. For it is, sometimes it is lonely when you, you let go of the habits you've been doing a long time that's not really healthy for your body. But so you feel lonely, you feel like you have to relearn to, to operate uh, within the new parameters. But, uh, but there is great benefit because once we, we've done enough work on, on that inner self and getting more strengths, more, more, more uh, ability to discern and to, to choose the way of health, that then the program mentally will be clear and we're going to find new level of freedom and health. <clears throat> For the, those who are uh, Ashtar, who is uh, the Lord Ashtar, who is the, 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 the commander of all the galactic police, came and said that uh, all the dark ones have been neutralized. They've been some of them have been removed. The other ones have been neutralized. So there is no more the problem. Freedom is there. It's just for us as light workers, we have to eliminate all the doubts and the fears and the shadows of the collective humanity. And for that, to understand that those who are inflicting the suffering on others are the most wounded of all. But before, instead, in, in, uh, they do not want to address their wounds, so they feel they so they're using the, 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 the distracting themselves and inflicting uh, suffering on others, which allow them to gain power. For for what may come in the in the media and the, as the next stage will be the revelation of all the satanic uh, programs that are so dark and that will create a massive shock for a lot of people that are part of those those um, those uh, networks are, 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 are celebrities people that are really known and loved by humanity but once we'll know what they've been doing behind the scenes it will be like a, it will be a great shock and some of those people that are also in the in part of this uh, those networks have accumulated tremendous amount of wealth that are stolen from taxation and and, and this will be this is seized and, and soon will be redistributed to all the people of the world so we're going to move from a system economical system of lack to a system of abundance for all and so to understand that even the darkest one, no matter what's been done, everything is forgivable, everything is healable, but they need, the, the mother needs for us to go back to that center, to go back to the love within and stop playing the old game of, of ego, self, the domination and, and, uh, and conflict and, and power over. We have to regain our inner power, discover our inner light from the inner wisdom and to become that inner wisdom, to become your higher self, to become your I am presence. I am my I am presence. My, my immune system is my I am presence for the, the I am presence resides in the upper heart, in the immune system. And, and the more we, you acknowledge that, the more you anchor this energy of light for the Christ, the Buddha, the Krishna and all the others are not object of, of worship that the, the, it is a misaligned source to, to worship those beings for those beings and they, they come from within we all have this inner divinity and light from within it is just when you meet a beings uh, those beautiful uh, very enlightened beings those ascended master they will channel to you this love and light and you feel like they're so much higher than you but in a sense they just they're just more connected to the inner divinity but they know they see within yourself that you have the same divinity and so it's about regaining that that inner light, that inner power to understand uh, how things work, to, to work from within and to, 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 to become the master of ourself. For the soul, the soul is, is really what we need to connect to. For the, the, the spirit as the lowest octave is the ego mind and, and the ego personality. That's what we have to let go. That's where all the problems come from. We surrender to the love and creativity of the soul. And from the soul, we'll, 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 we'll achieve the higher uh, octave of, 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 of the spirit, which is God and which is our true self. For all 
all beings were created in the image of God. We have this potential of, of becoming the highest the highest frequency, the, the, the frequency of all that is. For Spirit revealed to me many long, long ago, and I've been practicing that, is that you, you can achieve more in 15 minutes of meditation by going into the realm of infinity for any sort of discovery or scientific True, so for God knows all, all the, he knows all things and all means. There's nothing in the universe that God does not know. It's not a single atom or the galaxies, the, the, the past, the present, the future. Everything is known by God. And so by, you, by becoming one with God, you connect to this realm and you can receive all the answers and then you can bring it down. For my Master God explained to me in the early 90s when I first conversed with him that you can achieve more in, in 15 minutes of meditation going into the realm of infinity than in 50 years in a 3D lab. Huh? It's, it's like you far more. Uh, so it's about finding this way to, to align our physical, to clean up our physical and mental body so that we can ascend through the, the emotional body to a state of bliss, of joy, of grace. And, and from there, we'll be able to, we'll have the freedom to reach those higher planes and bring the light back down to us. And so I'm going to pull a few cards. The highest wisdom for us today is the harvest, so we're going to be harvesting the fruits of our work. There's, there's a period of great freedom um, and, and a renewed sense of life and, and rejoicing that is, that is ahead. What we need to understand is the breakthrough. It's the volcano that's, that's breaking through, and the breakthrough will not last, but once we break through, we have broken through. Uh, what we have to do is fulfillment, is the dream come true, it is a celebration. For, for right now, there is, there is so much suffering, it is hard to celebrate, but, but once we, we can already celebrate our freedom when it comes to us, and then we'll be able to, to assist the world in aligning with their own inner freedom, for we cannot free anybody else. We can only give them the direction, the key that allows them to find this opening, that freedom, this love, return to love. And the outcome is the devil's play, is the, the play of the ego. It's, it's, uh, there is all those... The, 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 it's like the, the, the ego is the devil, it is the darker side, it is the, the non-enlightened side, it is the one who fears, the, light, the one who, who, who wants to dominate, who wants to be right. It's a, so we have to let go sometimes of all our knowledge in order to surrender to the truth of God. And, and from there, we'll, um, it's also the, the card of materialism. We have to, to utilize this time to make the change today that we need to make you know, and, and continue to do your inner work. It is essential. And so to do this meditation and uh, to to um, to become uh, to become your light body and uh, to to uh, to do the work because the the, you, the creator cannot do the work we need to do the, the extraterrestrials may come down and eventually when we are ready not yet because we're not ready we have first to return to our own power we have to cre create the situation that will which will allow the, the, the for them to come but once they come they will everything will have to change they, they're going to bring up so much knowledge, love and wisdom, we're going to change, uh, sci our science will be changed, our technology will be changed, religion will be changed, politics will be changed, economic will be changed, ecology, everything is going to be transformed. But for now, we do have to do this inner work and, and regain this, this inner power, for we are the creators, we, we are energy, infinite energy beings that come from God, that are, that are created in the essence of God, but we have forgotten our true essential identity, our real identity, and so we which is in the causal body, the, the I am presence, uh, the, the causal body of I am presence. And, and so we, we have created this fictional identity, which we call the ego. And so, uh, it's, so we do want to say no to tyranny and yes to freedom and power to the people. <clears throat> And so, uh, so also want to say that every illness is a natural cure. We're going to discover that and uh, a natural solution for for. Uh, and so we're going to be able to to bring back to the state of health, and we're going to free a lot of people that are trapped within within sickness that that were kind of imposed upon them or that they have self-created, you want to ask yourself the question, what is my soul contract? If you, if you know your soul contract, then 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 fulfill it. If you do not know, go in meditation and. And ask the question and, and be open to receive the, the answer. Well, I hope this message was uh, interesting for you. I'm going to sing a song. Here it's a portrait of the great mother. It's symbolic of the great mother, of the three sacred flame, uh, pink, blue, and yellow, the three sacred flame of the, of the soul. On a golden background, right? it's, it's quite a nice painting, I like it, it's very, very unique. For my art is very unique, it's, it's a very Renaissance art, it's a new Renaissance that is starting. And so I'm here to, to bring about, to, to assist in bringing about this new Renaissance, for it will soon come into the public eye. 
And here is a portrait of the of the of the solar system with 100 of it's a recent painting of this year last year uh, <coughs> of the 100 paint 100 um, major planets of the solar system. And uh, so I'm going to sing a song. It's called One. For we want to return to the One. Huh? We are the One, the, the great One, the, the, the One that is all. And so it goes like this. Is it getting better? Or do you feel the same? Will it make it easier on you now? You got someone to blame. You say one love, one life, when it's one need in the night. One love, we get to share it. Or it leaves you, baby, if you don't care for it. Did I disappoint you or leave a bad taste in your mouth? You act like you never had love and you want me to go without. <clears throat> well, it's too late tonight to drag the past out into the light. We are one, but we're not the same. We get to carry each other, carry each other one. Have you come here for forgiveness? Have you come to raise the dead? Have you come here to play Jesus to the lepers in your head? Did I ask too much, more than a lot? You gave me nothing, now it's all I've got. We are one, but we're <coughs> not the same. Well, we hurt each other, <coughs> hurt each other, then we do it again. You say, love is a temple, love a higher low. Love is a temple, love the higher low. You ask me to enter, but then you make me crow. I can't be holding on to what you got. When all you get is hurt, one love, one blood, one life, you got to do what you should, one life with each other, sisters, brothers, one life, but we're not the same, we got to carry each other, carry each other, one. <clears throat> song said. Songs about it's from uh, you too, I think. I was to sing this song uh, for many people, other people sing it as well. I think originally, and so uh, so I thank you for liking, commenting, sharing. And uh, the card of the day is, uh, is soulmates. We, we we have to reconnect to our soulmates, it's to, to, to those who are so close to us that we're going to bring, uh, we're going to discover new connections that are going to bring us into new level of realization of this inner love, this inner connection, and will give meaning into our life that will also align us more with our, our sense of self and our, our soul plan. Huh? So it's very much about being true to ourselves and to, to remain. Um, to remain uh, solidly anchored within this light or hopeful if nothing else huh? so that's why it starts well thank you very much i wish you a wonderful day namaste namaste namaste